morning, I'm Lauren Hicks, lead pastor here at Pacific Christian Center in Santa Maria, California. It was in the year of 1896, my great-grandfather, Joe Richter, was born. He and my great-grandmother, Eva Richter, uh, were farmers in West Texas. And I remember as a child visiting their farm and staying with them and, and, and seeing the fields that they had planted. What I learned from my great-grandfather was that whatever seed you plant in the ground, that's the harvest that you're going to reap. You know, here in beautiful Santa Maria Valley, we are surrounded by farms and vineyards and orchards. It's really a beautiful place to live. We know that principle to be true as we study the agriculture around us. Whatever seed you plant in the ground, that's what you're going to reap on the harvest day. No farmer around this area has ever planted strawberries and reaped watermelons. No one has ever planted squash and mysteriously grew grapes. It just doesn't work that way. Whatever seed you plant, we can be sure that's what we're going to harvest. In Galatians chapter 6, verse 7, the Apostle Paul tells us this, God is not mocked. Whatever a man sows, that he will also reap. This agricultural principle is actually a spiritual principle in our life. And it works its way out in so many areas of our lives, whether it's marriage, whether it's parenting, even your career, whatever you want to harvest, you've got to make sure that you're planting those seeds in your life. If you want a marriage that is strong and will survive, if a marriage that is loving and compassionate, a, a marriage that is serving one another in sincerity, well, you've got to make sure that those are the kinds of seeds that you're planting. If you want children to grow up respectful and kind, you've got to make sure you're planting those kinds of seeds. If you want a spiritual life that's growing and thriving, make sure that you're planting seeds of worship and praise to God and daily gratitude and you're filling your hearts and minds with the Word of God. If you'll plant those seeds, then spiritual growth is going to be your harvest. I want to encourage you this morning to pay attention to the seeds that you are sowing in your life. You say, well, I didn't even know I was planting seeds. Well, guess what, friends? We're all planting seeds every single day. And we are planting seeds uh, in every area of our life. Whatever we're planting, that's what the harvest is going to be. I know that you want to see good things in your life. You want to see spiritual growth. You want to see a healthy marriage, healthy families. You want to see your life blessed. Let's make sure today that you and I are planting the seeds that will produce that kind of harvest. I know God will give us the strength to make that happen. God bless you. Hope you have a wonderful day in Jesus.